Hi everyone, my name is John Stan. I'm a doctor of traditional Chinese medicine and co-owner of Eastern Currents Limited. As you may or may not know, each of the products we sell here at Eastern Currents are tested for quality and effectiveness. That's why I'm very excited to share with you news about one of our newest products called Q Magnets. Now, I must say that I was a bit hesitant when we were introduced to another magnet product. The ones we currently sell have been serving our customers very well, and there did not seem to be a need for adding more. And that was uh, until we started actually to start to experiment with the clinical uses of cube magnets. We discovered how extraordinarily effective they are. 99% of the people we tried them on all had really amazing results. Normal magnets, as you know, all have a north and south pole. And these everyday magnets are called bipolar, i.e. with plus and minus on, the, on either side. And this is where things get really exciting. The Q magnets are multipolar magnets, and they come in configurations of four, six, and eight poles on each side. And these are called quadra, hexa, and octopolar magnets, respectively. So let me show you the difference with this iron filing field card. First, let's look at a regular bipolar magnet. You can see here that just by the pulling force is arranging the iron filings into the shape of the magnet. This is a typical bipolar magnet, seen everywhere. Now let's take a look at the quadrupolar magnet. You can see here that there are four poles being um, introduced into the fields, plus or minus on each side. Here is a hexapole magnet, and you can see six poles. Now you can take a look at the octopole magnet. You can see there are eight poles. Now what's really exciting is the research that was done by Holcomb, Wamil, and Pickett and McLean on the effects of steady magnetic fields on the action potential of sensory neurons. And this was done back in 1991. And they showed that multipolar magnets have a very clear effect on nerve firing rates. It turns out that the undulating magnetic field produced by the multipolar magnets de-irritates that nerve and it results in the reduction of pain sensations. Now I've tried these magnets in a number of clinical cases of pain, discomfort and injury. In the large majority of the applications, patients showed a really high degree of satisfaction with a large or a complete reduction in discomfort. In cases of physical injury, the multipolar magnets have a real effect in speeding up that recovery and reducing bruising, and all the while patients report a significant reduction in discomfort. When you look at the magnets, you'll see that there are many sizes and thicknesses. The thicker that magnet is, the deeper of the penetration into the tissue area. And the wider that magnet is, the larger the magnetic flux field penetrating into the body. On our website, you'll find a chart with all these details re regarding width, thickness, and depth of penetration. Now, before placing the magnets, you'll need to consider the area and the depth needed to stimulate the irritated nerves. For example, discovered in the hands, you use a smaller magnet along the joint lines. For pinched nerves in the lumbar region where you need, you need to get deeper, you want to use a thicker 6 mm magnet to get into the affected region, and so on. So knowing where the nerve roots, muscle innervations, and tissue depths are will help you determine where to place that magnet and what type of magnet to use. So the clearer you are at choosing the sites, the more success you'll have. Also, during the course of treatments, the pain may shift and you may actually need to chase that pain as it resolves during that course of treatment. I also want to point out two additional features of the magnets. And you can see that the Q magnets look like they have two layers. The thicker layer is the actual magnet and the thinner layer is the, uh, with the printed information above, that's called the flux plate. The larger magnets all have the flux plate and its job is to direct the magnetic field downwards to reduce the amount of magnetic energy emerging from the printed side. You'll also note on the printed area, you'll see a code for the product along with a little arrow. And the code will tell you 
the type of magnet, the diameter, and the thickness. For example, on this, Q, on this magnet, we have QF283, which tells you that it is a quadrupodal magnet with a flux plate and that the magnet is 28 millimeters wide and 3 millimeters thick. Um, and then uh, we have a hexapolar magnet, which is a um, HF20-3, and that means HF means that it's a hexapole. It has a flux plate and it is 20 millimeters wide and 3 millimeters thick, and so on. And the arrow on the printed side is an indicator, and it tells you how to orient the magnet on the body. So for best results, I always place the magnet with the printed side out and the arrow pointing up towards the head. Q magnets are a unique product that are a type of pain care that patients can wear. Apply the magnets using medical tape or even better, kinesio tape. Your patient commonly uh, will notice a change in discomfort within 15 to 20 minutes, and they'll continue to experience relief or actually resolution of the discomfort the longer the magnets stay on. And that's why we recommend medical or kinesio tape as it wears well for days before it needs to be changed. So how are these to be used clinically? Well, Creating a treatment plan with your patients, we know that the best results are achieved when treatments are done every day or every other day. In practicality, however, um, coverage for pay treatments can run out quickly, or patients just simply can't afford the fees that are associated with treatments that are every done every day. So this is where the magnets are beautifully solve this problem. You can use them as a continuing form of treatment in between clinic sessions. And here's how you do that. Before your treatment plan, tell your patients about the Q magnets. Tell them that um, there's a small rental fee for the magnet, but this is by far and large, um, the amount is much smaller than actually getting uh, treatments every other day as you normally would be required. Explain to them um, at the end of your treatment, if they agree to the process, you will attach the magnets over the uh, significant areas needed for the treatment. And you will tell them that they are to keep them on until they return for their next visit. Explain to them that by wearing the magnets in between sessions, it's a way of continuing to treat the problem and speed their uh, recovery up. And uh, by the way, to make things easy for you, we actually downloaded a rental uh, purchase form that you can modify to your needs um, on your website. So by renting them out at a, f at a fee per day or a week, your magnets will generate income and boost your success with chronic pain. You can even offer these magnets as a uh, retail sale product for continual home care uh, solution for your patients. There are just so many applications ranging from sports injury or training recovery to acute and chronic pain management that I see that over the next year, these magnets are gonna be a big part of our solution strategies for our patients. We're so excited to offer them to our Canadian practitioners and we look forward to hearing back from you about, about them. So thanks for taking the time to learn about this very exciting new product.